Thank you. Um, I would first and foremost like to really thank uh, Dr. Bhaskar Gupta sir, uh, SNC principal, uh, for, and he has, um, uh, it is our honor that you agreed to flag the rally, and after that we are going to start the walk. So um, I just wanted to brief a little bit about the morning and then at 10 o'clock will be the formal inaugural session where we are going to meet again after the rally. So the agenda for today is one sir flags the uh, walk. We are, and this walk is actually, is not just about cancer awareness. It is also about honoring the cancer fighters, honoring the families we lost to cancer and honoring the lives we lost to cancer. So this work, work is a very emotional work and also is a work to anti-tobacco campaign because 50% of the cancers are preventable if we can stop the intake of tobacco in any form. So that's the spirit of the work. And then once we finish the work, we're going to head back here and there'll be just a very light refreshment for all of us. And then we come and uh, sit here and then we will start the formal inaugural session. And once we complete the session at the end, uh, so the session goes like this. We will start with um, Dr. Chandrasekhar Das Memorial Award. And Dr. Kannan Sa and Dr. Uh, Kumar Kanti Das will be here followed by we are honoring the cancer fighters and uh, basically I have been working with many cancer patients since last five or six years since the inception of Breast Cancer Hub but you know most 90% are anonymous they don't want to step up to share their journey so very few step up and they are our bravers because their lives inspire others so we are honoring them with the greatest uh, with our the bravest hero award for 2023 the lives we lost to cancer. I have been, you know, um, attached to them for all these years and uh, it, it's, it's very difficult because they fought. They are, they were so brave and we wanted to honor them. And that's why we have the families of the lives we lost very recently to breast cancer and colon cancer. And for us, the families, we, it's a tribute to them and I hope we will do justice to the lives and the legacy, we will continue the legacy of the brave hearts. So that is the intention. So you staying here, supporting us, all the organizations joining hands, it is very meaningful because you are not coming here for Breast Cancer Hub, but you are coming here as a community because we are stepping up for the cause, for the fight against cancer because early detection is the key so that we can save more and more lives because I always believe we save a life, we save a family. Thank you. So I would request, sir, we would all uh, line up outside and sir will flag the rally and I hope there is no more rain so that we can complete the work in the spirit of our community. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Lokamutra. Uh, now I would like to request um, uh, Dr. Basarupta sir to uh, deliver a, a small speech for us. Good morning, respected gentlemen present here. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, a warm welcome from my side. Uh, being, I recently, it's hardly one month back, I took over the charge of principal. Before that, last three months, I was in different situation, like vice principal, then medical superintendent, and ultimately principal of Central Medical College. And whenever it comes here in, in the name of Dr. What I have to say, Chandrasekhar Dasar, he was an inspiration for me because from my studentship, he was an ideal for me. And when I entered the first day as a postgraduate student in Guwahati Medical College, he has identified me outside the hospital campus and he took me, oh, you have come here. Why? I told, sir, I joined here as a postgraduate. So, yes, you come with me. I will introduce you to the, your faculty HOD. And that is my remembrance. And since I came back here, he inspired me to join Sancha Medical College. And since then, it was a long journey and long association with sir. And regarding cancer, come to the point, ladies and gentlemen, very proudly I am telling that in such a medical college, we are coming up with the tier 2 level cancer hospital. That is the, having the every facilities of cancer treatment and 85% works has been completed in association with the Tata Hospital, Asham Cancer Care Foundation. We are hopefully introducing or this will be commissioned by the end of November or December, which will fulfill a long demands of this large area of around 40 lakhs population of the entire Barak Valley. And we hopefully and very much optimistic 
with the best of our technology, with the advantage of uh, the Tata consultancy and Tata in the background. All activities and all the execution will be done by the Tata group in association with the Central Medical College. So it's a proud, it will be a proud moment for us. And I believe majority of the patients need not go to outside for the better treatment because every facility is latest up to date. 180 bagged hospital will be launched very soon. Almost 85% works has been done. All the important machines, including the MRI, LIDAC machines, everything has come up. And they are and the atomic commissions, uh, Baba commissions of atomic energy has already given us the clearance from their end. So we are very much optimistic. So it's a long demand from this area and uh, this region which will be fulfilled and the dream will come to true. And we, ladies and gentlemen, the problem with the cancer is that very initially for a few months, few years, it does, does not give any complaint to the patient. It is only the awareness level and it is a change of our lifestyle modification and indulgence to the various, I mean to say, tobacco and other toxic materials, alcohols and others which ultimately lead to us exposed to cancer. So ladies and gentlemen, as a general person or a common person of the society, everybody of us is, can play a very important role by increasing awareness. If we can spread even unnecessary intake of medicine also sometimes we bring the fatality. So, once again, I will request all the friends present here, you should come forward and join hands in hands. And we know so many cases of the cancer warrior who have been detected in proper time, there is a proper treatment and they are still surviving for 5, 7, 8. Even I know a lady from a one doctor's mother who was uh, when diagnosed as a colon cancer in 1995 and immediately she was operated in Tata Cancer Hospital, she survived till 2019. So this is the best example which I know how you can come about or come across the cancer. So it is the only thing this, it is our improved awareness. Suppose that in case of breast cancer, every lady passing 30, 35, 40 years, they should check, check their organs. They should, they should not feel any uh, shame if they found something abnormal or lump in their abdomen or something abnormalities in the uh, breast region. They straight away go to the doctor, can consult with a surgeon or a physician initially and ultimately being diagnosed. And once again, I am telling Central Medical College has the facility of mammography, which is a very important tool for your diagnosing of breast cancer at the very early stage. So, my dear friends, you can come forward and take the advantage of this. Any ladies present here having somewhere a feeling of lump in the breast can come forward and take the advantage of doing mammography in Central Medical College. So hopefully this will be a good run. It will improve the awareness among our society. So I hope this, the, with the intention with the families of our late Chandrasekhar Das sir, particularly her able daughters, and all the NGOs who are joining hands by hand, they will also come forward for raising awareness in our society so that we can come to a cancer-free, uh, what I have to say, society in our life. Thank you, thanks you once again, and good luck for the whole day. Thank you. So the wristband, the significance of the wristband, you will find three colors. The blue is supporting breast cancer in men, pink is supporting breast cancer in women, and purple is supporting all types of cancers and all genders. So please wear the wristband proudly. Thank you. We save lives. We save lives. We save lives. We save lives.